Kamwata is expected to meet uh, his bail conditions today after being granted bail on Friday, uh, 8 August. Earlier, his son Augustine Kwesi Amwatin said processes were stalled due to unforeseen circumstances. Eric Amwatin was arrested and jailed in the United States of America in 2006 for trafficking 136 pounds of heroin worth, uh, with a street value of $6 million. He returned to Ghana on Thursday, 7 August, after seven a 10-year jail term in an American prison, but was arrested immediately on arrival at the Kutuka International Airport for allegedly possessing a forged passport. Right, and so we'll get more on this matter as we get in touch with our reporter on the ground, Kabna Cheng Cheng. And the matter is pretty simple. Has he met those bail conditions? And is uh, and is he or is he not out of the grips of the police uh, for now? You recall that the matter was taken to court and Erica Martin was granted bail, but his uh, inability to meet those bail conditions has left him in police custody now his son augustine uh kwesi Abwate had said things have not gone as planned now chencha hene has joined me over the telephone hello Kwebna. hello germany where are you at the moment uh, i'm currently at the nima district police headquarters right here in Accra. Mm. and mm. what have you gathered about his release well since we came here we've been here over the for the past one hour or so uh and it has to do with the release of uh, Eric Martin, whom we are told has been able to meet the bill requirements uh, said earlier. That was uh, an amount of 20,000, 200,000 Ghana cities, I must say. Uh, since I came here, I've seen some some family members, unlike what we saw the other time at the airport, where there were a lot of people in party paraphernalia, party t-shirts, a lot of people from his constituency also uh, to show their support and solidarity for him. This time round, uh, we can just see a few family members, just just around eight or nine people, not so many as we saw early on. Uh, none of them is willing to speak to the media. We've tried our best to get something from at least his son who is here, but no one is willing to speak to the media. All they are saying is that uh, we should just hold on, we should hold on. Uh, they don't speak to us now, we should just hold on, don't speak to us now. Right. <laughs> but, mm. Go some ahead. few minutes ago, some few minutes ago, uh, we just saw them send some food in for him. And other information I'm gathering is that uh, he'll be released soon. How soon, I can't tell, but I'm sure, I'm told he'll be released soon. That's probably after eating. He's going to, they're going to see to one or two things with regard to the paperwork. Mm. Then they can officially release him. So we are still standing by. Now I can see a few more vehicles being parked here for him. I think about two of them here now. So I'm sure any moment from now, uh, Erica Martin should be released. Right. If, if it's met the bail condition, do we know why he's still in custody? I, I can't really hear you. What do you say? I'm asking if he's met the bail conditions, do we know why he's still in custody? Uh, I think they're still, uh, it has to do with the paperwork. They are still trying to sort out a few things with the paperwork. So uh, probably once everything goes through, all their appropriate authorities append their signatures and everything, obviously it's going to be released. So that's what we are still waiting. I see. Thank you very much for that update, Kwabna. Kwabna Chen Chen Hene joined us from, uh, he joined us from the Nima police station where Eric Kamwatin is still in police custody after he's met his bail conditions. He's expected to be released a little later.